Good day, everyone. My name is Hamido Faliki, and uh, today I wanted to actually. Uh, this is not a sponsored video. I personally decided to do it, and uh, I'm not sponsored by whether the company Felicity Solar or any other person. So, in this video, what I'm trying to do is uh, uh, I'm going to tear down this Felicity lithium ion battery. Uh, the reason is that uh, I bought this battery like a few months ago and uh, for the start I have been using it fine then uh, all of a sudden I cannot discharge it at any reasonable current and I can take it back because the company has a warranty and if I take it back they are going to check whatever the problem is and uh, repair it otherwise they will send me a new one but I personally wish I could see the inside of the battery before I purchase it. Uh, but there is no video on YouTube on the teardown of the Felicity lithium ion battery. So I say, why not do it myself so that people can benefit? Uh, so, uh, and uh, I know that the problem will definitely be from the BMS because uh, there was a time when I left one old inverter on the battery and. Uh, I drained the entire battery, the entire capacity of the battery, I drained it to zero. I had to use my other charge controller to put it back to life. So I want to know what type of batteries are inside so that I know the type of BMS that I will order off AliExpress. So let's get started. If you look here, this is the warranty sticker. You see, tear up the warranty is invalid. And I definitely am going to tear it off. Just have. <laughs> <laughs> okay, this, let me just tear it like this. So I bought the warranty already. So if you look from the top, there is a fuse box here. These are the timing nuts. Uh, I don't know, did I need to open this one? Let me try. Okay. This is a 150 amp fuse inside so I think I will have to take it off so this container has knots here one two three four i think only five six it has eight bots so let me start here Good. So now this is your cover, and uh, as I lift it off and I turn it around, so this is the BMS here, and uh, the cells are inside here. So let me bring the camera closer. You can see this is the BMS. The BMS is attached to the top cover. And uh, if we look down, these are the batteries inside. So 
let me see what i can also do i have to say this i'm not a pro with the tear down of lithium ion batteries but from all the looks you see this are the balance cable there are five of them and uh, the bms is here the negative terminal and the positive is here and uh, i don't know what this level is fls mb 05b but it is definitely leveled here positive and this is the red cable connected to the uh, terminal and uh, i think i have to go a little further to see what is inside so let me this metal protection here let me untie it so when i remove this um seems like this one there is a cover here let me see whether i can remove it there's another cover here so 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 this looks like i have not done a lot of or i have never done even a tear down before but it seems like this cover is held by this boss bar so i will be i unscrew it And I'm removing it here so now I can see my I can see the cover let me put this in here okay so okay I can remove this cover now but I have to remove the terminal there. Oh. Ooh. So 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 I need to remove this knot too. You see there is some mark here, mark a something a41 there is this six i've never really see this type of uh, battery and uh, i'm not sure this where this is connected this is the balancing cable well this is the positive so i will have to maybe open the rest let me open the other one so what I will be doing, I will remove the positive and the negative terminals from the battery.
and uh, this is a balancing cable so what I will be doing is I will just move it good so now we are left with the battery I will have to remove this so So now I'm not sure what to do next but from all the looks is this section is a cis bolt and this is a cis bolt so because if I put my multimeter if I measure across here Good. If I measure across here, you see it's 6.88. If I measure across the other two, it's also 6.8 something. So basically, this cell is 6 bolt, this one is 6 bolt, making 12 bolt. So that is why they are connected here in series. It seems like the battery, uh, the cells are glued to the metal container from the bottom and, uh, and somewhere from the side. There is nothing to protect the battery from hitting this side or the other. It is only glued to the bottom. Well, I'm no expert in tearing down a battery. But uh, of all the teardowns that I have seen in uh, YouTube, I have not seen anything inside like this. So this cell, this side is a 6 bolt and this side is a 6 bolt. So they are connected in series to make a 12 bolt. So I don't know how they connected the BMS because all I can see here is this it has some levels it has some levels you see this b negative b1 negative b2 positive and the last one is uh, b1 positive and here i have b1 negative b2 positive and uh, what is annoying here is this is b2 positive and there's another one b2 positive so i don't know it seems like the BMS is only for two batteries, yes. How they connect it, I don't know. Well, I'm going to put it back together. Later, I will sit down and look at it and find a way out for myself. And uh, thank you for watching. If you find this video, any part of this video important, or you can like, comment, or control both. Thank you. Well, it took me a little time to figure out this uh, configuration. You can see from deep inside here when I try to open it, there are 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 cells here. So these 6 cells, they are all 3.2, 3.2. So this is the positive terminal of the cells and this is the negative terminal of the first cell. This is the positive of the second cell. This is the negative of the second cell. This is the positive of the third cell. This is the negative of the third cell. This is the positive of the fifth, uh, fourth cell. And this is the positive of the, uh, sorry, negative of the uh, fourth cell. So here and here are cells. So I don't know how they take to connection to connect it. But uh, how did I figure it out? I use the BMS, the balancing cable. I measure and I check the difference between each of them. So when I measure now, what I have 
is uh, for matrices. The first cell is 3.48, the second is 3.4, the third is 3.425 and uh, 423 and 3.447. Let me use the multimeter to test the voltages on each cell. You see, this is the positive, this is the negative. We have 3.48, and uh, so this one is the first tip of the next cell and this is the negative you see 3.40 so this one is the first tip of the next cell and this is the negative you see 3.43 and this is the first tip of the other cell and this is the negative you see another 3.446 so this is definitely a 4S, not a 2S, as I mentioned before. Um, but now to find the terminal of the other cells is not possible. So I will be connecting them to this cable when I buy the new BMS. Um, this is the BMS that come with the battery. I think if I look down, down, you can see some sort of level. Um, LPBR. 150 so this is the model of the battery so i don't know where to find this uh, bms and it seems like it is glued to the metal container so i will use a heat shrink from the back to take it off and i see what type of uh, bms i can find to replace this one with 